Hello and welcome back everybody, this is Mohamed Said with you again. In this video, we're going to get through how to download Unity and go through some basic features or tools that you can use. So let's get started with our new video. So first of all, open Google to download Unity. Go to unity.com and then get, uh, press on get started to create your account. Then you'll find yourself in this web page so uh, here you get a couple of options you have personal plus pro and enterprise so um, each one of those has its own features um, obviously you'll see uh, obviously you see that pro is the best it has uh, the most features but as beginners uh, you can always go with personal which is absolutely free um, you don't need to pay or anything to uh, get it started so when you press on get started you're gonna see that um, here there is uh, some stuff that you get here you can start up with uh, empty 3d fps lego micro game karting or platformer so after just reading that press on start here and press on agree uh, agree and download i'm just gonna cancel that because i've uh, downloaded it so after doing that, go to your search bar and search for um, Unity. You're going to find that there is two versions of Unity. There is a Unity and Unity Hub. So open Unity Hub to create a new project. So um, it's going to take some time because when you're the first time, it takes some time to load. So you see here that um, it's loading now. Now it's opening. So I'm going to come back when it's done. And yes, here now it's done. Uh, you see that here uh, when you download it first, you see that there's a couple of tabs. You see projects, learn, community, and installs. So just go to projects or you can go to learn to learn some new uh, like projects or tutorials. Go to projects, press on new, and then uh, you're gonna see that you get this other tab here you see that uh, here are the templates and here are the um, here are the project names and the location so first of all you can choose uh, whether you want it to be a 2d game 3d game or high definition RP Lego micro game which you can use to get started it helps you understand stuff uh, they already have it as templates. You have an S FPS micro game. It's also a great example um, of stuff like that you can use. You have karting, mobile 3D, mobile 2D. You have AR, VR. You have a couple of options here. You have a lot of option options. So I'm gonna go with micro game because we're still beginners. We still we just started. We're go we want to learn how to use Unity. So press on Lego micro game. And just call uh, call it whatever you want. Press on create. It's gonna tell you to verify your age. So uh, just put in what uh, your age, uh, age is in there. And um, each every and every single time you create a new project, it will ask you. So after that, here you have to agree to their terms of service. Agree and continue. Now um, it's just gonna take some time loading, not just a minute. It's so fast. Um, then you're gonna see that there is open projects here it's loading and you're gonna see that um, after that you're gonna see here create from template it's gonna take some time to open so I'm gonna come back when it opens guys so yeah it's uh, it's still not done guys um, uh, it's gonna take some time now yes now it's back uh, now after that you're gonna see that it launched an app here so when you open it you're gonna see that it just uh, does some more loading and it's gonna open so uh, it's gonna take some time then it's gonna hopefully open it still says hold on here now it's open uh, so let me get the um, app on that screen it still has hold on now it's opened so first of all you have to uh, load tutorials uh, it still has hold on because uh, it's still not done we're gonna press on load tutorials now it's uh, completely done now you can start using your application 
So I'm gonna maximize it, and you see here there's uh, all tutorials and start. So I'm gonna show you some stuff that you can do with it. So first of all, when you open it, it's gonna be looking like this. You have some tutorials here, and um, you have each and every single time you press on one of them, it's gonna take you to a tutorial. So each tutorial you press on, it's gonna help you understand its uh, title and what it does. So, uh, first of all here, if you want to add anything, uh, you can press on here, add and add anything. So, let's say you want to add floor, you can uh, search from here. So, yeah. You see that here in pref tabs, you have uh, some stuff that you can add here. You, you see in models, you have some models uh, that you can add, floors and stuff. Uh, here you can see there are materials that you can add here Lego you can add materials and a lot of stuff so you can go through these stuff and see what they do uh, so here with this hand you can use it to scroll around you can use the uh, scroll bar on your mouse here you can use this to um, zoom in and zoom out you can use the right button on your mouse to uh, like change your view so yes after that here when you press here you can move your character and move anything on your screen so you just select what you want to move and then you move it so if you guys are familiar and uh, if you follow me uh, for a long time you're gonna see that I did a video on Python and when you reach 50 subscribers I created a video on Roblox studio so this is kind of close to it so Yes, there's some, and there's a lot of stuff that you can do without code, but there are stuff that will uh, need code uh, to do it. So here you see that there's a lot of stuff that you can do here. Uh, first of all, when you look, you're going to see that it's a bit complicated, but it's not. When you get used to it, you're going to know how to use it. So here, uh, let's go to scene and start it. So is, I didn't create this, or uh, when you press on... A Lego micro game you're gonna get this this is a template that they already created uh, they made it to help you understand and um, use unity so okay now when I press on this uh, button it's gonna start loading so if it's uh, I'm sorry guys that it's that small I, I'm gonna try to make it bigger so you guys can see it uh, that's the biggest I can make it sorry so uh, now when you press on it, this is what you uh, usually have. Uh, so you can move your character anywhere. I moved my character to spawn here. Uh, you can go around and mess with some stuff. Uh, just let's say when I uh, come here on this bridge or when you go anywhere, uh, you can just add some assets or you can add some stuff that, uh, that makes you, when you go there, you're going to die. So uh, to change your... Let's go to um, player. Here you're gonna see that the position and stuff. You see the camera brain, the pickups, the environment, the actual light, the lights coming from here. Um, you have a game manager, you have an event, you have a lot of stuff. So when you press here, you're gonna see we're on the player min, uh, mini thing. So you can uh, make change the acceleration. Um, you can make a lot of stuff. You can make, there's no gravity at all. Uh, you can make the jump speed a lot more faster. Let's make it that it's gonna be super fast. Let's run that. So guys it's really fun you can uh just go ahead and play with it and if you're just beginners you can also do that like me yes i'm also still a beginner uh, you can do that you can come here and there's some stuff that you can use uh to learn uh you see that there's some tutorials here let me just show you uh what happened I think that's because I made it so fast I didn't even see anything so okay I made it just a thousand so it's so fast uh, you can't see it so yeah that's it for this video guys I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and if you did please don't forget to smash that subscribe button and thumbs up so yeah bye see you in the next video bye